you have secured a good rank in the NEET and now you are at this crossroads. Whether to choose a college in your own state or a reputed national college like Ames. In 2016, when I had the chance to study at Ames Monasio, I had many doubts. I had never stayed away from my home. I was always a day scholar. And on top of that, many of my relatives told me that the food is going to be very bad, that I won't be able to eat that. And the language is going to be entirely different. Oh dear. I was pretty sure that I will be able to manage Hindi, but oh dear, that's an entirely new thing. So I was also a bit skeptical. Then some of my relatives told me to choose Ames Bhopal or Ames Jodhpur because it's Hindi over there and you will be able to manage that. But I was fixated on Ames Bhubaneswar because when I checked that Careers360 website in 2016, Ames Bhubaneswar was ranked 16th or 14th in the country. So that meant that Ames Bhubaneswar was the best among the new Ames at that time. Then one of my dad's friend's relative was studying in Ames Bhubaneswar. So we called him, asked him whether I will be able to manage the food and language over here. Then he told, no problem, you can easily manage that, just come here. So then I decided that I will be studying in Ames Bhubaneswar. And let me tell you this, by far that's the best decision that I made in my life. In this video, I try to break down the pros and cons of studying in a national college like Ames. Let's get this started. For those of you who are new to this channel, I am Alamin Ashra, a final year medical student at Ames Bhubaneswar. I make videos about time management and productivity, health and fitness, and my journey of becoming a doctor. If you like to see them, then subscribe to my channel and ring that notification bell. The first and the benefit that I like the most is that this pushes you out of your comfort zone. Because when you go to a college which is out of your state, the people are gonna be new, the place is gonna be new, the language sometimes is gonna be new. And you have to learn to interact with all these new things. And you don't have the safety net of your parents or your home. If you mess up, you have to sort that out yourself. So this will push you to be more mature and make you capable enough to tackle all that life's gonna throw at you in the future. So that's the number one benefit. Then the next benefit is the environment and people in the college. Because the students that are gonna come to a national college like Ames or Jibma are gonna be the cream of that generation of students. So these people are gonna have a lot of dreams, a lot of big, big goals. Most probably you will be knowing this. You are gonna be the sum of the personalities of five people that you spend most of your time with. So when the people around you are pushing themselves harder, are aiming for bigger and bigger things in life, you will be forced to do that. You will do that. And the people who are already there, the students who are already there, they would have already set examples. They would have already set a different culture in that college, like cracking USMLE, PLAB, or cracking the entrance examination in the first attempt with high ranks, or starting a startup, and so on and so forth. So I'm not saying that this is gonna be not there in state colleges, but it's gonna be a lot more in the national college like Ames or Jibma. And then the faculties. The faculties are gonna be top notch. I can tell you about my own college. Like many of the faculties in my college are from Ames, Delhi, and we even have a teacher who was in Johns Hopkins for some time. So the people, the students and the teachers, their quality is gonna be really high in a national college like Ames. The third benefit, that is branding. So when you study in a national college like Ames, Jibmer or other reputed colleges like BHU and all, you will have this brand behind you. And especially when you study in Ames, this Ames tag carries a lot of weight. If you're planning to go out of India, like UK or US, then studied at Ames, that tag is gonna give you an edge over the other people who studied in other government medical colleges. So you are a guy who doesn't want to go out of India, you want to work in India. Then also this brand is gonna give you a lot of advantage. So when you go for an interview to work in a private hospital right after MBBS, if you, a guy studied in a national college like Ames or Jibmer, 
is performing on par with a guy who studied in a government medical college then the chances of you getting selected are way more than the other guy getting selected then if you are planning to start a startup or something like that then this brand is going to get you more investors like a group of students from aims is starting this venture then that is going to give confidence to those angel investors they will be ready to put in money because they know that the people in aims are capable and the next benefit is pg reservation as of now there is no pg reservation in the sister aims but a case has been filed and most probably when you guys who are going to join in 2020 finish their mbbs there will be pg reservation in all aims i guess and colleges like bhu and all have pg reservations even now and the next benefit is the amount of money that you have to pay so at aims you just have to pay 5500 rupees this covers everything and it even includes a 1000 rupees caution deposit which you can get back when you leave the college but as far as i know no for seniors have asked for that So these all are the main benefits of studying in a national college. So now I will talk about the disadvantages of studying in a college which is not in your state. The number one disadvantage is the language. I say this is the biggest disadvantage because it took me almost 2 to 3 years to learn enough Odia to be able to communicate with the patients properly. So this was a hindrance in my learning because i couldn't take the histories in my second year and third year properly it's not a deal breaker you can always learn that language i have never put any effort in learning odia whatever i heard are my friends speaking in the college from that only i learned so if you put effort to learn the language then it will take you hardly 3 to 4 months to learn it properly so that's a personal problem if i had put in the efforts then i wouldn't have suffered So if you are planning to go to a college where the language is entirely different then please study that language in first year also. Then the second disadvantage that is the food. The, usually the food that you get in a college mess is not that great. And on top of this if you are out of your state if you are far away from your state then the type of food also changes. This food won't be of your liking and like I said earlier it's mess food. So it's going to be even worse. Nowadays this is not a big deal you have swiggy zomato and all those stuff then the third problem is distance and expense of travel if you are a single child of your parents and your parents are leaving alone then if some emergency happens nobody will be there you won't be able to reach them fast enough and when a pandemic like covid-19 hits if you don't make the decisions fast enough you might be stranded at your college you won't be able to go back for 3 months maybe so that's that and whenever you want to go home you will need at least 5 to 6 days as holiday and this traveling is going to cost you a lot of money always so these are the main advantages and disadvantages of studying in a national college like aims so i hope that you are able to make an informed decision after watching this full video whether to study in a government medical college in your own state or a national medical college like aims if you are having some doubts whether you should be a doctor then please do watch this video If you like what you see leave a thumbs up and share this with every one of your friends so that they can make an informed decision. So I'll be making a video on why you should choose Aims for Nature. If you like to see that then subscribe to my channel and ring that notification bell. Bye till we meet again.